Hi, this is Juliet Loves Beginning with a message called Safety and Right Now Unity. It runs what it runs until it doesn't run it anymore. Ego sends beliefs about being in charge of and controlling certain specific things that are not real. Ego provides a perception of time and fills time up with perception of being in charge and controlling as a separate one. Now look at this. Be you in charge. From ego's perspective, allowing the whole of all of us to be in charge is having no control. From spirit's perspective, being under the control and authority, the dominion and union of the whole of all, is the only control worth having. It also has the advantage of being the only control that is real. You seem to be here in this place with many who seem other. If you let them be as they are, you're letting them be perfection. If you let you be as you are, you're allowing yourself to be perfection. Ego can talk to you all day long about what it is specifically that perfection is, but that never makes ego's version of perfection real. Whenever you hear thoughts ego is sending about the ones called other, anxious thoughts, analytical thoughts, hostile thoughts, ask for assistance in seeing their right now perfection. Everyone's right now perfection has nothing to do with the details the ego assigns to different characters. Perfection is quite simply the truth of all at all times. You have to look prior to the body and all stories associated with it to see this. Take a look at your perception of your ability to resist. You think that by building fences and erecting walls that you will keep the entity you call yourself safe from invaders and intrusions. We bring this belief into the light so it can be seen and released. Your safety lies in your right now unity with all, no exceptions. Take a look at your perception of right doing versus wrong doing. Ego prompts you to look at bodies and then it sends you analytical thoughts about these bodies. Ego tells you who is doing what and then sends thoughts about which doings are right and which doings are wrong. Not a single doing has actually happened, although your perception of doing gets used by spirit on the way home. Seeing as how doing isn't real, you may as well give your perception of it over to spirit to use on your behalf and the behalf of all. You don't know anything about anything. Any seen as separate thing is not real, but reality is always right here. Allow this ever-present and unified reality to be your guide in all things, and this is what will be most obvious to you in every moment. All of your misery comes from allowing ego to guide, to tell you what you are seeing and what it means, to tell you what you as separate want and don't want. There is another voice to hear, and this voice brings peace. We come and speak peace, and we stay in peace. We know that you are at home here in peace with us, and it is our delight to show you. Thanks for listening.